Take three and welcome back to abandoned. Shit. Welcome back to abandoned places. We're here at near the actually the asteroid graphite mills right there, but uh no well we're here at a sort of abandoned railroad track. Um actually is abandoned. Not this part, that's still functional, but uh oh damn if I haven't seen a train since junior high. We're on the area what used to be the old track. Uh, there's really not much left of it. Um, besides some bits and pieces of wood here and there. Uh, in those trees, there's a lot more. Well, right here, for instance, that looks like a whole, uh, tie. Um. In those trees are, you can see a lot of the old pieces of the track. Presumably, I think that's what they are. Uh, just off the side. Uh, here, here's a good example. Uh, sometimes you'll find in the ground the, uh, some of the real, the old railroad spikes. Just kind of floating around. But they could just be from this track, because there's a lot missing. Mainly because people like me like to, to pull them up. Sorry. God. Should have paused it. Um, not entirely sure what this is. Might have had something to do with the track. I don't know. But I'm just going to leave it there. Um, the main point... Sorry. I'll pick that up later. Or right now. Main point of interest is coming up as we go along this, uh, the old track line. The old bridge is actually still here. Right next to the, the current one. Um, it's very, it's much more plain to see here that obviously there was a railroad track. Uh, it's clearly coming apart. Uh... Which is why I'm going to be a dumbass and I'm going to attempt to cross it. I did this like a year ago, but... Well, maybe a little bit more. No, it was over a year ago. Less than a year ago, I think, actually. Yeah, this stuff's starting to give way here. Shit. This was a really stupid idea. Um... You can kind of see here that, uh, the, uh, the metal part here is starting to rust away, uh, yeah, there's, like, bits of rust here. Uh, the wooden beams are nearly completely overgrown, or, and, I, and they're, they're just rapidly falling apart in my fingers. It's mostly just dirt, mostly hollowed out by this point. These metal parts will stay around for quite a while, though. Uh, my guess is they'll probably clear it up someday. They have to, right? Unless they want the shit falling into the road. Uh, the metal railing is starting to warp. God, I'm so goddamn sweaty. Um, yeah, this is not safe to really cross. And I wouldn't recommend it. If someone actually tries to stop me, I'm going to be pretty pissed. I don't know, how did, that, how did Bridget's Herabithia turn out? Not ideal, as far as if I remember right. You know what? I'm not doing it. I might be a man, but I'm not a dumbass. Oh, right here. Some of the screws and stuff are starting to poke out of the ground. Uh, further below, it's a uh, wow. You don't have to, I, I, I haven't been here in like over a year, so it's been a little while. Yeah, just look at, uh, just compare the two, and it's pretty clear which that this one's really starting to go downhill. Uh, I don't think they're going to tear it down anytime soon. Uh, the wood beams are crumbling, but they wouldn't cause a problem, in my opinion. 
Uh, they pretty, pretty easily be cleared out. The metal part will be here for a long time. Maybe. Try not to break my ass on this bridge. We'll be soon be coming up on the other abandoned railroad track. If I have any air left. In me. Uh, yeah, right around here, you can see some of the old ties that are still here. At least one, no two. After that, it gets pretty sketchy from there. The trail kind of runs cold, but after that... Um, you might find a railroad spike around here. But aside from that, there's not really much else. So yeah, uh, this is personally one of my favorite spots to go when I'm out hiking, and uh, it's pretty easy to reach. If you're in Katanning, just take the railroad tracks to it. I don't know. I'm not good at directions, obviously. But uh, yeah, we'll probably see you soon.